Today we're going to take a look at Mouse Without Borders. It's from Windows Garage. And it's basically where you can just use, instead of these two keyboards and two mice you see here, you can transfer files and documents and text, copy text and everything, just with a single keyboard and a single mouse uh, seamlessly across four systems. Uh, so with that, let's take a look. Now, if you're like me, you may have more than one system. I'm going to show you here, we have three different systems here, a laptop and two uh, physical PCs that we're going to set up to control all from the same mouse and keyboard. And you'll eventually have something like this. You can control up to four systems with the same mouse and keyboard all through software. As you can see here, it creates an Ethernet connection between them that the mouse is actually routed through that in order to control all three. And as they move left to right or right to left, it changes between them. Now to go get this, just go to your search screen and go type in uh, garage mouse and you'll find the link here. Go to the one that uh, has the download link over here and go there and that is the download for Mouse Without Borders. So we'll download it, go download very quickly. Uh, was it wanted to save? I'm just going to go ahead and hit the run button here. And uh, I'm cut to the chase here. It says, Welcome to the Mouse Without Borders. Uh, and we'll go ahead and go and do the install. Uh, it tells you what it does. It says it, uh, it's a prototype that allows you to access all your computer on the same thing. And then go ahead and say, Accept their stuff and install. It'll take a little while to install. And there it is. It's successful. And you're ready to go on this computer. You have to install this on every single computer. So you have to go to the, to the different computers to do that. Now what you'll see eventually is you'll say, let's get started. And it says, I already set up yes or no on the other computer. So we'll say no because I haven't. There's a code here that you're going to have to put in that lets the security say that it's, this mouse can control between different computers. You're going to put the same value in each computer. So as you go off to the other computer, you do the same thing you did here and put in the code. Then once it figures out that everything's correct, it'll go off and uh, connect them all up. So eventually you'll get this success. You're almost done. So now that you have, you can copy and paste, you can drag files, and you can share the keyboard as well. So we're going to go in here and uh, do some of that to show you how it all operates. So off screen, I've gone ahead and done that. And so I say, yep. So it's all done, and now you see the two systems are connected up down here. You'll see that uh, I have a Win 7 computer and a Win 8 computer that are connected up here. And it has the, my internal IP address, and it shows all that. And as long as you use the same security key, it'll uh, do it. And you can do this up to four monitors, as you can see here. And you can also drag these around so that you make sure that they're positioned left to right, because as you drag the mouse from left to right, you're, all, you're of course, going to want to go ahead and do that. Uh, have it dragged correctly. Now you notice I've moved my Lenovo over there to the to the right because it's going to be on the far right over here. So if we say there and say close and we're ready to go with those two computers. Now off screen I'm going into my Lenovo laptop and I'm configuring that so that when I bring this back up there it is as it appeared down there. So we need to use the same uh, code here on the Lenovo to make sure that they're all talking the same security code. Click on there and it says connected and I can do all three now, again up to four computers on the same screen. So this is the setup you have to do on each one. Uh, you get your code for one and use the code on that one on all the rest of them. And now we're ready to go look at uh, how this works across the screens. So we're going to do that. We're going to take a look and see the actual appearance of how this works as you're working. So here we have with the Windows 8 computer on the left and Windows 7 computer on the right. Uh, and you see there's the mouse and as we move it across between the physical monitors, there it is back and forth works just fine, no lag, no nothing. Uh, your mouse works great. I mean, you can launch programs. You can go over each one of these and run any one of these programs. For example, I can go over here and run the sports program over here. On a Windows 7 computer, I'll launch a, a text file I have about some uh, information. And if we come back, there's that uh, running over there. So again, control both computers from one mouse and one keyboard. So now we're going to uh, look at it a little bit more sophisticated. We're going to go ahead and look at how to copy and paste text in between it. So we come over here, and here's our screens over here. I'm just going to show two of them for now. But I've typed in the word test over here in Notepad. I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to right-click and say copy. I can't tell you how many times I've been on two different computers and I need a URL to be passed back and forth, and I have to send me an email or have a messenger in between them. But now I just simply go over here focus over here and say paste and it's good so the copy paste buffer is working 
Now we're going to go ahead and drag a picture file, but you can use drag documents, uh, pictures, whatever. Uh, there is some limitation because I tried to do a video and it wouldn't drag it. It wouldn't do it because it's too large. But here's a uh, picture called 0.21 on the right-handed, which is a Windows 7 computer, over here to a Windows 8 computer, separate separate system. And we're going to drag and drop it. And there's the status. It's 2K file received from Bob Win 7. We come over here and there it is listed there and it's dropped over here inside this destination on this other uh, computer. So there you are, that's mouse without borders, it's mouse and keyboard actually because you can, as long as you're in your mouse focus change, you can type on either keyboard on either system, left or right, it doesn't make a difference and you can work from uh, both with one keyboard. Uh, so have fun, download it today from Microsoft's uh, website and uh, get rid of the extra hardware you have. And don't forget to subscribe to Old Guy Geek. Have over 150 Windows, Windows 8, and Windows Phone 8 videos, and any more every day.